Hi, this is Lauren from LSP Actions and I'm going to walk you through using my Silhouette Noir Photoshop Action Kit. These actions will turn your backlit images into beautiful detailed silhouettes for your clients. For best results, uh, plan and shoot for silhouette. This can be as simple as when backlighting your subject, for example in this gorgeous image by Anna Brandt, you stop the exposure down a little, like, you know, by taking your ISO down. Um, and shoot for silhouette and then you can pop it back up again. To do this, you want to position your subject in front of a bright light or a backlit background to light your subject from behind. Um, if you shoot natural light, this could be as simple as positioning your subject in front of a window, perhaps. Or for studio, you could pose your subject um, on a white lit background, as Anna's done here, that is lit uh, from behind. Or you could pose them in front of a large softbox diffuser, for example. Um, as I said, this image was shot by Anna Brandt and was planned for silhouette as you can see uh, from the way the subject is backlit and underexposed. To start with using the actions, you're going to want to load them into Photoshop and open your action palette up here. And you will see you have the LSP Silhouette Noir action kit. You have instructions, the silhouette action, and then several um, extra actions in there to help you really tweak and refine your silhouette. You can either um, hit the action here and hit play on grey editing mode, but I much prefer to be over on button mode where you can see I've colour coded the actions for you. So I'm going to get started and I'm going to play the Silhouette Noir action. This is setting up the Silhouette um, layers. As you can see here that's made um, a fabulous Silhouette straight away really and it's kept all the detail in the skin and the hair. Now all I need to do is fix this background up a little bit. So I'm going to play the white and whites brush this will play the action out and it will give me a brush already selected. I'll make that a little bit bigger. I'm going to use 100% opacity, 25% flow, making sure my brush is on normal. And I'm just going to paint over here, whitening those whites up. There is also a pure white layer here. I'm going to click on that just to tidy up these edges a little bit here. And there we go. That is before and after using the LSP Silhouette Noir. Please watch the other videos um, included in the series if you'd like to know more about using this action. Um, I hope you really enjoy it. Oh, I didn't show you the tints, did I? We have some tints here. So for example, you can play a tint and this will apply the effect over your entire image just to give you a really customized silhouette. You can play them all, turn them on or off, or slide the opacity as required. I hope you enjoy using these actions, and please watch the other videos if you would like more examples of these actions in use.